what is up y'all it's your guy mj welcome back to my youtube channel welcome back to another video and i'm back with another reaction video for you guys so right now i'm going to be reacting to t-squad 4 versus 4 went crazy i guess this is an ugly sweater theme battle i guess this happened around christmas time so i'm a little bit late on this but it don't even matter we still about to get straight into it and i'm not even gonna yap for too long <laughs> That four on four, that four on four is just freaking insane. That good way to space out the talent, but that's a crazy four on four. Let's just watch it. I'm not even gonna say four. Bounce is one of my favorite T-Squad dancers because his versatility, his is like, I'm just left speechless watching this opening because he is just so versatile and crazy. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Y'all might be thinking I'm pushing, but I think he has the potential to be like a Chris Brown dancer, the type of dancer like, and I'm not even joking or pushing anything. I'm just giving my honest opinion. And then the fact that Bounce is young too, like, he, I could see him being a professional dancer outside of T-Squad and stuff like that. I would love for him to be a professional dancer and see him, like, being a backup dancer for a big-name rapper. Like, him and Chris Brown would go crazy together. Like, that would be a crazy duo. I hope Bounce do continue dancing, even outside of T-Squad, like, go on to be a professional dancer somewhere. I could see it happening because Bounce is just freaking crazy. Oh, the music why y'all owe his hair like that? You gotta chill. You have to relax, bounce, cause yo, oh my gosh, I'm gonna shut up. <laughs>
Bepio. Taxi is just so unserious. Look at Mo. They are so unserious. Okay, come on. Yo, what? Did y'all just see her? Look at her right leg. Oh, my ankle would have been. Yeah, I would have been in the hospital. I would have been in the hospital. Walking like that scene off of Friday when he got knocked out and he was like, That's my butt, punk. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you. <laughs> no, no, no. It was the one we was like, My grandmama gave me that shit. 
say this and I may be wrong but I don't think they show execute enough love give her enough props or enough love that is me from outside looking in obviously again outside looking in I feel like execute can be shown way more love than what she's being shown she's definitely the underdog for sure <laughs> I'm 
Perfectly executed. Her name is execute for a reason. And that y'all crowd don't even hype her up like how y'all hype everybody else. So that's what I mean by execute does not receive a lot of love. Like she's just so phenomenal and she do not receive a lot of attention, love, nothing. Like she's just so much of the underdog. And I wish she just got her flowers for real because this girl is crazy like she's so versatile and just crazy like when you see her dance she reminds me of a dude even with envy too like when them two when i see them two dance it reminds me of a dude because they just so like smooth with it 
y'all get on trying to say, but execute deserve way more love than this. Like y'all just so quiet. <laughs> They're killing right now. They're eating, and I can't even be. I, I can't. I can't even like they're eating right now. I feel like Theo, Bounce, London, y'all getting defeated by Sassy or Boss. Like talking. I see a lot of dancers like that. Like once somebody start talking mess, the other team gets defeated already. And y'all could tell like Theo, Bounce, London, Execute. They look defeated. Like their energy is not high. They look so defeated. But y'all way too talented for that. Like it's y'all should be eating back, but. I'm going to say they're winning because of the creativity that they're bringing. Don't get me wrong. The team with Bounce, Theo, and London, and AZQ, they're very creative. They they kill. Like, they know how to dance, but it's just, this team is being more creative. That's how I move was crazy. I thought I saw Nick. I thought I saw Nick. She got up. She got up. She played that one off. Oh, 
I got to see them hug. Damn, so I see you hug. Good thing, good sportsmanship. Good sportsmanship. A good sportsmanship. I was hoping everybody is still cool afterwards. You know, I know in a dance battle, it, it, the dance it, it gets it gets real intense. Like words will fly out that you really don't mean, but it just get real intense. But I'm glad to see all of them had good sportsmanship and shook each other's hands afterwards. But like I said, the team with Theo um, bounce. Lady London and Q, they looked at real defeated and their energy was just not there. The team with bound, I mean, uh, bossing them, you could tell their energy was there. They was ready to come. They were just on a bully mode. So if I got to pick a winner, I will give it to them because their energy was just crazy. They was creative. Don't get around, the other team had some good moves and moments too, but I just feel like they was on a bully mode. Like, a freaking little boss and, and sassy and they was on a bully mode and that's how you gotta be but the overall the battle was still a good battle i feel like if they was to do like i want them to do a rematch but like a more like a battle zone type of rematch where like they go against each other but they got time to come up with choreo and stuff like that that would be crazy y'all can't lie that would be so crazy like oh uh, tommy give us that please give us that but that concludes this reaction video for today guys if you guys like this video please give this video a fat thumbs up please comment down below if you're new to my channel please hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell so you don't miss whenever i post a new video but until then guys this is your girl mj and i'll see you guys in the next video bye y'all